What's going on guys? Lindsay back here with Side Hustle 247. And today I want to talk to you guys about how I made 300 and it was probably about $325 picking up somebody else's route for the day. Um, so it's pretty cool. But before we get started, uh, I want you guys to make sure and hit that subscribe button. Make sure if you guys have any questions, please drop them in the comments section down below. Hit that notification bell so you guys can get notified anytime I make a new video. Um, also, uh, again, if you have any questions, hit me up in the comments down below or just let me know your thoughts. Smash that thumbs up button. So let's just jump right into it. Uh, I'm in a little different vehicle today. I had to borrow my mom's cause somebody smashed into the back of mine. I think it's gonna be like $11,000. But uh, the good thing is this is an SUV. So I can pick up some more boxes and add some extra money to my paychecks. Um, so anyways, yesterday or friday um it's tuesday now we just had the fourth of july weekend so friday one of the route drivers uh went on a little vacation trip i don't even know long weekend or something and so i picked up his route um so it's basically is three loops it's a long day um, for the most part and the reason it's a long day is because when you do one loop there's like some time in between each loop of doing so basically you run the route uh, you hit all the stops and then you'll have to wait like a couple hours and you have to run it again and then you have to wait a couple hours and run it again so you basically start probably about nine o'clock you could probably start a little bit longer i'm sure there's ways to cut down the time in this route um for the most part your night is gonna probably end if you start about nine maybe ten you probably end about seven um so it, it's a long day um you make i think the first two loops i think you make like 110 dollars they don't really take that long um it probably took me about three hours each loop um, most of it's just kind of driving you're stopping in you're picking up uh for me i have to pick up some specimens you have to pick up some mail you have to deliver some mail um and i didn't really well i did i had to pick up a couple deposits so you're you're dealing with money mail and specimens um pretty simple stuff overall uh, i never mind like picking up the mail as much uh, not a big fan of having to deliver mail. Uh, just it, too much, just a lot of garbage to deal with. Um, I'd rather just pick up something like boxes or whatever. So that being said, um, it was $110 the first two loops. And then the night loop pays a little bit different. I think it paid like $120. So total roughly around 330 again i could be off five dollars um i can't remember whether the night loop was 115 or 120 so either way i made uh, about 325 30 dollars for eh, roughly it was probably 10 hours of work it wasn't really 10 hours of work but it was 10 hours of my time um so I guess it, it wasn't even 10 hours. Let's, let's see if I start at 9, 10, 11, 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Yeah, the, about 10 hours. So I'm, my brain isn't working real well. So, um, so that's pretty much it. Um, again, I, I've probably told you guys that I like try and train on everybody's route at some point in time. A at this juncture, I probably don't even need to necessarily be training on it. If people just wrote down, what I get people to do is just like write down the particulars, what I'm picking up, uh, what I definitely need to hit, what days I need to hit them in case I have to do more than one day. Um, so, because I know some days, like on this particular route, Mondays are, are big bank deposit pickups. So, pretty much most of you pick up the bank deposits uh, all on Monday. 
Um, also on this this particular route, Monday, Wednesday, and Fridays, you had to go to the to the post office and pick up the mail for uh, that particular hospital that I was dealing with. Um, so the Tuesdays and Thursdays, you don't have to do that. Um, so kind of some of the days change. Um, some of the places you only have to hit up like twice a week. Um, so besides that, what, it, what you kind of just start the route and start, you got to go to, uh, pick up some, you know, in case you're delivering mail, you have to go check to see if you're delivering mail and things like that. Um, I don't know whether this is a standard operating deal for, for a lot of places out there. Uh, again, we kind of have this like special situation where um, we work out of the hospital. So it's kind of like our office, our hub. Um, so, you know, this is the main spot for all the different uh, hubs that this particular hospital group um, owns. So we, we run all over the all over the area and deliver backwards and forwards, shipping and receiving specimens, all sorts of things. Plus they own just like urgent cares. And um, I mean, they do stuff for all sorts of things from uh, mental hospitals to um, old folks homes, uh, all sorts of things. We deliver boxes, mail, uh, do deposits. Most of the routes do something specific. So, um, if you're picking up most of, most of the routes will have a certain area that they work in. They have to hit that area two or three different times throughout the day. And they're doing some specific like mail, uh, boxes. So everyone I think pretty much does specimens. Um, so, it's it's a different variety some people just pick up specimens and then you have people like on on call like me um and i kind of do a little bit of everything uh i've been trying to pick up routes honestly like if it was up to me i'd be picking up everyone's route as much as, as possible it's just set money and it's it's better money um obviously even if i just did the the first two loops which that's the day route. Sometimes like somebody has a day route and then somebody else picks up the night loop. So they only make like, let's say $220 a day and work five days a week. And then somebody else picks up that hundred dollars at night. Um, so uh, different people do different things. So, uh, I mean, for me, if I had the opportunity, especially when my kids are back in school, I'd like to just have the, that day route is perfect for me. You know, start at nine, you probably end up finishing around four o'clock. You make $220 a day. And then, you know, maybe you can pick up a weekend. For me, I'd pick up a couple more weekends a month uh, doing the mountain route where you make like $400. So um, it, it works out nice. It would work out nicely, you know, make a little over a thousand a week and then pick up another um, 800 every other weekend. So, you know, you're making roughly $5,000 a month, which isn't phenomenal money, but you know, it, it's not bad. You know, it can get me by uh, for what I need to take care of. You know, I'm not gonna be living the extravagant life of, uh, but at least I get to be with my kids, take care of the things that I need to take care of and, um, and, and, you know, make a living. It, again, it's not going to be extravagant. It, if you really, you know, want to make a lot of money, you got to be hustling on this job. Uh, you know, it, if I didn't have kids, I, I'd be working, you know, minimum 10 hours a day and weekends, hustling as much as I could, stacking as much money away as I possibly could. Um, that's that's what I'd be doing, you know, because working for me is just like, I'd rather be working than sitting at home watching TV, uh, watching Netflix. So um, that's, that's basically, so I always go back to the same thing in these situations. Um, routes are the way to go. 
Um, somebody just hit me up on one of my things saying he, he quit doing truck driving, uh, found a route like three days a week. And then, you know, he was doing on call for the rest of the time. So, um, if you guys uh, got experiences like that, please drop them down below. I'd love to hear from you guys. I love hearing about these things. Eventually I'd like to like start interviewing some people and things like that. Uh, I think that would be really cool. If that's something you guys would be interested in me doing, um, uh, let me know. I don't know how many people would be worth, uh, would be willing to do interviews and stuff like that. I'm not going to do anybody interview anybody in, in, my situation where I'm at, but I would love to hear from other people in different places. So, um, I hope you guys found this valuable again. Uh, so last Friday I picked up a, a, a route where I did, uh, 300 and 325, $330. I did the mountain route on, which is the weekend route. Uh, there's a couple different routes. Um, that's what we call it here. Uh, so, which, you know, you make about $400. Um, and then besides that, uh, so I made a good amount of money in two days. It was like $700 uh, in two days, which is really cool. So you pick up things like that and you can make extra money. And then, you know, uh, you, you do as much on-demand work as you can that you, your time will allow you. So I hope you guys found that uh, valuable. Hit me up with any questions. Let me know your experiences. And uh, you guys make sure and hit that subscribe button. Hit the notification bell and the thumbs up. And I will see you guys on the next video. Peace.